Hello everybody, Wild Bill for America here, and I say we need a little bit more Islamophobia in this nation. Now the proper term for it is situational awareness, using your brain to honestly evaluate and identify threats to you, your family, and your nation. Americans better wake up fast, educate themselves on Islam, and prepare to fight because Barack Obama is bringing us a Christmas present from the Middle East. Hundreds of thousands of Muslim men who have not been vetted at all. <laughs> Gee, what could possibly go wrong there? Now, I recently said that my English Defense League friends have information that mosques are being used to store weapons for terrorists, and I was soundly ridiculed by the liberal left. Well, France has started raiding mosques, and guess what they're finding? Massive stockpiles of rifles, ammunition, and explosives in the mosques. That's what mosques do. A mosque is not just a worship center. A Muslim mosque is also a military outpost for jihad. Always has been. There are over 2,000 mosques in the USA, and the Obama Muslims are scouting out our neighborhoods. Now, it used to be that a terrorist had to sneak into the USA and hide out while planning attacks. Now, thanks to Obama, they get a free plane ticket, plus an apartment, cell phone, and free food. I've stopped asking how low the Obama administration can go. There is no limit to the treason of the Democrats. At this point, I would not be surprised to see an Obama program to issue AK-47s to Muslim immigrants so they can protect themselves from the Tea Party. And then there's the useful idiot factor. American citizens, young, poorly educated, with no moral foundation at all thanks to the liberalization of education. They've been taught by the liberal left to have no loyalty to this nation. These dumbed down kids are looking to join ISIS and other terrorist groups to commit jihad against fellow Americans. Terrorist recruiters seem to focus heavily on blacks who have usually been prepped by men like Al Sharpton and Louis Farrakhan, friends of Obama. <laughs> Imagine that. The attacks on police officers and burning of cities were heavily influenced by left-wing politics. Oh yeah, evil men are working to instigate bloodshed in America, and Islam is their chosen vessel to bring this violence upon us. America needs more Islamophobia, please. If we don't get it through education and intelligence, then we will get it the hard way when the land of the free and home of the brave explodes in our faces. If you believe in this message, please consider becoming a monthly donor by clicking the link below. The fight's getting serious, and I need to stay in business. Thank you to all those who have donated. Let's keep it going. This is Wild Bill for America. Thank you for watching, and America, bless God again.